New at five, a double murder suspect who allegedly tried to hide out in our area has been caught. Action News Jax was first to alert you on our mobile app when this potentially dangerous man was taken off the street. That 21 year old has been connected to the death of his stepmother and 10 year old brother in Pennsylvania. Police say that he was then spotted three times in St. Augustine. He was eventually arrested in West Virginia after a combined 1600 miles of travel. Action News Jax, Lorena Inkland is live in St. Augustine. Lorena, it's possible that others could face charges if they helped him in any way. That's a possibility, Tanika, although the U.S. Marshal's Office would not tell me if they're looking at anyone in particular. Now, Turner, he's from St. Augustine. He even claims this city on his Facebook profile, and he still knows people here, some of whom have already spoken to investigators. This is video from a Facebook Live that Jack Turner did on Monday. It lasted only 24 seconds. He doesn't say anything, but you can hear him breathing heavily while people comment, urging him to turn himself in. Turner is wanted for theft out of Pennsylvania, but is also considered a suspect in the death of his stepmom and 10-year-old brother. The five-day manhunt that started in Pennsylvania and continued in St. Augustine ended Wednesday when a Crime Stoppers tip led police to a Greyhound station in Charleston, West Virginia, nearly 700 miles away from where he was last spotted. The U.S. Marshals tell me a taxi dropped him off at the Greyhound station in Jacksonville Tuesday. Turner was on his way back to Pennsylvania when he missed his connection in Charleston, West Virginia, and was caught by U.S. Marshals. Now, right here, the St. John's County Sheriff's Office, they're no longer assisting in this case. It now passes over to the U.S. Marshals and the Pennsylvania State Police. As for the motive of the crimes that he's accused of in Pennsylvania, that is still under investigation. But he will now be taken back to Pennsylvania to face charges there. Reporting live in St. Augustine, Lorena Inclan, CBS 47, Fox 30, Action News Jacks.